bass resonator here. Inspired by Daniel Cooper, uh, playing around with different types of oils and lotions. So I decided to use some toothpaste at the bottom of this uh, heart. I painted in place with this tiny little needle. It's got maybe a millimeter tip. Anyway, I, I painted a little design in there. I'm gonna, this is UV resin. I'm gonna cure this, then I'm going to put a, a um, backing on that is, um, almost said hallucinogenic, <laughs> holographic. <laughs> and then I'm gonna take it out of this mold and I'm gonna clean out that toothpaste. And then I'm gonna fill in the cracks with some, uh, some more holographic powders and then uh, see how it goes from there. When Daniel does these um, different creations of his, he uses different nail powders and stuff. Well, I don't have any of those, but I do have some interference powder that I've used successfully in the past. So I'm gonna use a little bit of violet and gold on this heart. Um, I'll try a few things, see what I get back to. Well, I had a modicum of success by putting a little bit of um, chameleon gold powder in there. That chameleon gold from Let's Resin. And then I also did, when I pulled those out of the mold, there was still some of that toothpaste in the mold. So I thought, why not? Let's try it. So I went with the red and it left a crackling, like a broken heart type of thing. And that, that looked kind of cool to me. And I made a little one as well. Oh, get in focus. And then. But those, that mica powder wouldn't stick. Don't know why. But anyway, kind of fun. Thanks, Daniel Cooper, for this. Maybe I'll do some more inventions or creations. Actually, not a creation, just a copiation of something that Daniel did. Till later, Base Resonator signing up.